So my name is Jody, and I've had Huntington's in my family, I guess as long as my family's been around, but we've known about it now for about 20 years. Uh, my dad was diagnosed with it somewhere around 18 years ago, and he was already symptomatic then. Um, so it's, it's been a, most of my life uh, that I've had Huntington's disease in front of my mind and studying it and kind of obsessing about it and wanting to be able to control this, this monster that eats up our family and realizing that you can't. My grandmother's passed away now. She died and um, she was pretty private about it. She didn't really want to talk to people about her symptoms or mention it and it was a very, very private family. Um, it wasn't something that you would tell anybody about. It was something that you shamed and you hid and you did not speak of. And, and that's the way they were. And so when it came to knowledge within my family, um, at first my father kind of forbid my mother to even tell the children about it. And he could, you know, just watch mom struggling with knowing and watching her break down and fall, not being able to tell her kids. And then I actually ended up having to fight with her to get the information out and figure out why, why are you so sad, what is the problem, yeah, and um, so we worked through, through that and with dad's transition through the disease, now he's at the point where um, he, he, you know, he, he's not responsive, he's not talking anymore, he's, he's really at the very end. And I've kind of taken on my own position and my own comfort with it and saying, yeah, you know what, I am okay talking about it. And, you know, I've had those hard talks with my family and said, you know what, I'm going to be talking about it. I went and I did the youth mentor training and I've done this and I've, you know, been trying to do some things for the Huntington Society. And so it's taken that that long period to get the, the family comfortable with knowing that, okay, I'm stepping out with it. I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to tell the world, I'm going to blow the horn and I'm going to get involved. And so that's kind of where I'm at here now at conference. This is my first time at conference.